I said, this is at 350. It's like a donor unit for that one that came in. This one here, like I said, it's that drag racing unit that broke it. I really only need it for the case, really. But he broke the other one too bad to, to put the bell on to cut it off. Oh, instant rip of my glove. As soon as I put it on, awesome. The governor cover off of here. Governor's free, needs any gear. I mean, we'll, I'll just move over all the parts off of his. Anyway, so it doesn't really matter. What? That's weird. Hmm. Somebody knock the clip off in there or something? Later, snap ring off of here. So maybe the spring in it? Sometimes this can be a little bit of a bitch. All the goo crap stuck in there holding it in. It's just an O-ring in there. It's kind of like a press fit O-ring. There it is. Yeah, it's just corroded. It's even so it's even swollen. Yeah. Looks like it's seized in there. It's got shitty metal rings on it. Alright, let's see if we can really 
hope I can get the pump out, but without getting the puller. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm not being real hard. I'm just kind of going in between the low stack or the intermediate stack there. And it's a washer pump. Kind of blows. His is a bearing pump. Anyway, I don't want to use a washer pump on here. Size is bad anyway, it's all grooved up. Today. Switching all the guts over. I just finished anyway. Get the band out of here so you can get the drum out. Just lift up on it, pull. Kick down the band, it's all rusted. Roll it sprag tight. Drum's finished, he needed this drum. This one's bad. Plates are hit, but again, I mean, it doesn't really matter, but the drum is screwed up. It's all grooved inside of here from the pump. Let's take this forward drum, this forward drum. Oh, yeah, okay, you can use this drum because his is all messed up right here. So we got a good drum out of it at least, it looks like. I have to press the shaft out. That input shaft is finished. It rides into that bushing. Not a big deal. Swap his shaft over. The drum's good. This drum is finished. It's a two-piece ring gear. His has a one. I wouldn't run this in something high horsepower anyway. I'd only run the solid piece. Sometimes these can be a bitch to get with these pliers I got. Nope. Not lucky. Planet. it. His flying's look good, but his planet was fine. He doesn't need this part. He just needed the two drums in the case. The shell's all rusty, he needs sandblasted. A little slop in it. These new bushings saveable for somebody else or whatnot. God. Yeah. yeah, that's not good. They don't have the 
plug spring in here correctly and the snap ring. Yeah. Is it rotated? No, of course. Of course it is. Alright, well, let's see. Sometimes when it's rotated, you can get lucky. And if you just bend the clunk spring down and out of the way, it'll help push it up. But not always. Just bending that clunk spring so it's no tension on the unit. Looks like it popped it. And it did. A lot of times guys will fight that and they can't know why because it, it rotates into the lugs which it was but when I beat the tar out of that and flatten that out I'm not going to reuse it anyway it releases the pressure on it and the center sports rusted and it's sandblasted could save it for somebody good ring gearing you see how bad chewed that bushing is that damaged the input shaft I mean it's just rusty manualless gear so good I was gonna say where's another steel yeah, I got that right and just junk but so yeah, I mean the case is good some of the parts are salvageable for somebody else, not him, other than the drum, minus that shaft. Like I said, we really only needed this one for the case. Which is, eh, it's alright, it's not too long. Yeah, definitely needs some work though. Thing. I got the case ripped I gotta work on we gotta cut the bell off of it he's gotta bring me the bell to put back in place I'll get it all cleaned up I gotta get him a pump a bearing pump I gotta get the direct drum I gotta swap that shaft for his into that and then build it. He had a couple little burnt plates, like some slight scoring on the, I think it was the forward. I don't know, I don't want to really dig through all this crap, but he had, uh, and it still looks really good shape for having a whole year on it. Got the strip. But uh, I think there was just one of these reds was just showing a little sign of wear on it. And then when he broke that, the converter took out the pump, took out the part of the forward drum where the thrust bearing is and the back of the pump and also the direct drum it was all from the drive shaft failure, I believe, or a bad U-joint or, or something. That's it, now I gotta get to cleaning. So yeah, peace out everybody.